either. You're gonna leave here and understand how fucking awesome it is and you're gonna take full advantage of it and be a winner or you're gonna sit and dwell on all the negatives of it and be a losing player. I get everything wrong, it's just that I can't recall it because once it's wrong, I'm moving on to the next thing. Like dwell, dwelling on what you fucked up on is the quickest way for the next thing not to work. I'm just not really good at respecting my weaknesses. I'm not good at dwelling at my weaknesses. I'm not good at acknowledging my weaknesses. Why? Everybody else is doing that for you. I think to win, you need to be your biggest fan. You need to focus on your strengths. We've all got our weaknesses, everybody. I just think the people that win respect their strengths more. And you, you've got literally, literally eight years until you have to make a decision if you want to become a professional lacrosse player. Instead of dwelling on, oh, everybody doesn't think I can, go throw the lacrosse ball against the wall. None of this is gonna play out if you don't get great. You're gonna lose to them if you don't get great. So like every minute you even think about it, turn that into thinking about how to become great and put in the work to become great. You're dwelling and looking at what you don't have versus looking at what you have. If you spent all your time on what you have versus what you don't have, you would be the happiest girl on earth. Stop complaining and dwelling because nobody gives a fuck. Thank you. <laughs>